Hello, hello, veggie fam. It is another Sunday recipe time with your girl, Ashley of Frobulous Veggies. We gonna do it on this side. And I did my own sound fix, whatever. Y'all know I'm a dork. <laughs> this week, special shout out to my auntie, Shell. Hey, TT. She wanted me to do something for grilling, okay? So, we are gonna hook her up because she said she bought some portobello mushrooms and she like, I don't really know what I need to do for that, Ash, but... I'm going to need you to hook it up. So I'm going to hook it up for her. So what we have, we are going to feature portobello mushrooms. And I wanted to grill some onions too to like give some color and depth because these are going to be like burgers. But I like mine grilled, you know, my onions. So we don't do that. And my favorite go-to that everybody is a showstopper. Everybody love it for y'all who like hot dogs. We have these from Life Light. And it's called Smart Dogs. Completely plant-based certified vegan y'all certified vegan i mean we gonna hit all the little areas and then of course for a side it's not really the start of the show but we're just gonna like feature this too shout out to bush's baked beans for finally giving us vegetarian beans shout out to y'all so i don't have to worry about pork being in my like baked beans you know so that'll just be a little side that's a little side star of the show but the real stars are here okay and just like y'all requested i'm gonna definitely continue to do the overhead so let's get into it all right so here is the grill we're gonna feature today it's technically the smokeless broiler from salad master shout out to y'all yay i still use it yes i do mm -hmm. we're gonna take some canola oil right boom you know and go ahead and just Put it on a paper towel and just make sure nothing sticks because we don't need no sticky situation. Also, if you're ever using this, if you're a Salad Master customer, make sure to put water in here because it will smoke up. <laughs> okay. All right. Just saving you some time, you know, and smoke detector alerts. Okay. Uh, so I went ahead and did the uh, olive oil. I drizzled a little on this side because one hit it. Doing this is a little hard. So yes, drizzle olive oil, we got pepper. I'm gonna make sure we're gonna do salt. Let's see if you can see, <laughs> salt. Okay, and then my usual seasonings, you already know. Um, I like to do garlic powder and onion powder. So, let's see if I can get the onion powder. We go and then we'll do the garlic boom. Boom. okay and then we're gonna flip it and put it on a grill so that's the part I'm gonna show is the flip in the grill hot dogs you don't need seasoning for because they're just gonna be so yummy by themselves so it's time for the grill after I flip and do the same on each side so make sure you do that Okay, so we are back. As you can see, we have the portobellas, the hot dogs, and the onion going. I wanted to make sure to say too, make sure you rub in the olive oil. Do a nice little doop doop in there. Rub it in there so that the seasonings in the olive oil gets in there because that will help it to just be so flavorful. I put the hot dogs in the middle because they're just little babies, you know. You're mostly just making sure they're heated up and thoroughly just warmed. And then we have the onions. So, what I like to do, because of this broiler and the grilling and everything, to make sure that the portobellas really get cooked, I do a little tint like that with foil, specifically for them, because the onions kind of get done, but specifically for the portobellas. That way they can make sure to fully cook under there. So, we're going to give it about five minutes on one side, flip it five minutes on the other, and let's see, you know, per the next video it might change we'll see but let's test that theory out okay so i stand corrected it was three minutes and 30 seconds <laughs> Ooh, look at it and it's already everything's cooking up so three minutes 30 seconds on each side and then everything will be done so you'll see the finished product shortly all right, veggie fam, that is it. How did you like it? This recipe was really quick and easy. So I would say everything took a total of about six minutes on this little grill. Now granted, this is an electronic grill, small grill in my house, so it might be a little bit different for the bigger grill, 
always just keep an eye on it. But yeah, I think it was about 3.35, I mean, three to four minutes per side, okay? And you get this lovely grilled food. I mean, perfect for Memorial Day weekend. And I did a little extra, you know, because I, I like to be cute and give presentations. So we have avocado, we have sliced tomato, we have red leaf lettuce, and then our veggie baked beans. You are all set. I mean, of course, we're going to have the nice little pretzel buns, too, for the nice little picture and presentation because I love presentation. So you will see the whole finished product, but this is how you grill vegetarian vegan style. This is actually uh, vegan. This is vegan. Uh, the beans, of course, are vegetarian. But yeah, this is how you do it. So thank y'all so much for tuning in for my cookout version of Sunday Recipe Time. And as always, we are cooking up fresh greens on the daily. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. Make sure to follow me on my Instagram, eat froglish, at Frogless Veggies website, eatfroglessveggies.com. Thank y'all so much and have a good Memorial Day weekend.